Marielle, mom and a girl with plans, and I am planning for the week of October 16th through the 22nd in my classic happy planner. And this week I am using this groovy Halloween sheet from my Whimsy Luck shop. And I wanted to do something just kind of simple and quick. So I grabbed this. I grabbed this book of just colorful boxes from the happy planner. And okay, <laughs> I tried to order some checkered washi on Amazon and I clearly did not look at the dimensions and I ordered this. <laughs> I ordered this this is yeah this is not washi it's some kind of packing tape but you know okay um I think I'm gonna try to use it I've had this for like a year and it just sits here and I think I'm gonna actually just YOLO it and put it in a spread so I thought this would go well together. So let's just go for it. I think it's kind of fun to use different things and I don't know. Okay, yeah, <laughs> packing tape for sure. But anyway, I think it'll be fun to use something kind of different. I'm gonna cut this off so I have it like, oh my gosh, ready to go and don't lose my edge here. Um, I don't know what I'm doing, but I thought it would be kind of fun. I'm, I know I'm gonna, here, let me put this somewhere. I'm worried I'm gonna cut it and then it's gonna flip back on itself and then I'm gonna like never find the edge because I swear it's always so hard on packing any kind of packing tape to find the edge. <laughs> so I'm just gonna cut. I'm literally just cutting a random piece. Oh my gosh. And I'm just gonna go for it. I don't know. It's kind of, oh, it's big. I should have cut it shorter and not like taking up the whole spot. What if I just kind of do this? Oh my gosh, I'm just, whatever, right? It's all about experimenting, <laughs> having fun, except packing tape is really hard to cut. Okay, you know, I, uh, I don't, maybe I should have stuck it on to, like, I don't know. You know what, whatever. We're gonna just put this down right here. There you go. <laughs> it's kind of cool because it's clear. I don't know. It's kind of messy. It's, I don't care. We're just having fun. I'm just having fun. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm going to put, oh my goodness, three of these down because you know how I do. You know already. Well, I like to put things in threes. Okay. So, um, this is such a mess and I feel like there's probably an easier way. Oh, I should have done one of the, you know, like I have one of those things for packing tape that yeah, this, these little scissors are a little better. Oh my gosh. You know, like the little tear thing. I probably should have done something like that. It's just so big, but whatever. I'm going for it. Wait, should I put this one here? I don't know. Yeah. Why not? Oh my gosh. So big. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna add a third piece. I'm kind of thinking that washi is just not gonna happen for this spread, and that's okay. Oh my goodness. I like to experiment with different things. Okay, I've never used packing tape, but um, I'm making a big fat mess. But I love to put different things like scrapbook paper and other kind of, I don't know, just like unexpected things in my planner but this was not exactly like an item I had in mind, but I saw it sitting here on my desk and I was like, I'm going for it. I am going for it. Okay, that one's a little wrinkly, but we're just gonna keep going. Okay, so I've got these kind of big chunks down. And I kind of, I mean, you could probably do this with like, uh, what do you call it? Um, like a pattern boxes and kind of put them randomly or scrapbook paper also, or I don't know, at Christmas wrapping paper, kind of anything. So I wanted to keep, I don't know what, if there's, I mean, I could bring out the purple and the orange in here. Not a bad idea. Or I could, I was originally thinking black, but I was initially drawn to, 
these because they look they look like tombstones right like I don't there I know they're arcs but to me like they're kind of tombstone-y I don't know that's that's not a word but you know what I mean like they just have the vibe maybe I'll grab this orange one and I don't really want that star on there I mean I could leave it but I could I'm probably gonna cover it up all right let's just let's just see what happens here wait which okay I'm probably gonna have to put something there and there I'm trying to see what side I'm gonna put this on I'll just do this why not here we go. I can see the little boxes underneath, but it's all right. That's all right. All right, let's see if there's like any like pastel purple in here. I'm just trying to keep it. There's regular squares. Let's see what kind of arcs we have. I really wanna just stay with these colors. So it's either gotta be purple, orange, or black. I know there's black ones, so I know that's like a good kind of fallback. I can use other shapes like I could don't do I could turn this one upside down I'm gonna I might do that somewhere like that I don't know they just kind of have that whole that whole uh tombstone look I don't know I think it could work I think it could work so let's just keep going and see what we've got I've got regular boxes in purple but I think that's probably going to be the only uh, tombstone, right? There's a black one. I'm going to grab a black one. I really wish there was a purple, but that's okay. Let's check this side. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We could luck out. Let's see what colors are on this pastel side. I didn't really look. Oh, ha! Yes. Okay, putting this down. We've got, we have purple. See, if you just, if you just believe, no, I'm just kidding. If you, <laughs> I didn't even look through this, but there's lots of, yeah, colors. So we have our little purple one. This is perfect. Let's see. And I've got black, so, and I've got circles. So we can definitely make this happen. Okay. I think I want to put, if I'm doing black, I want that one lower. So I'm going to put I'm just going with the whole tombstone vibe here. I know they're not really tombstones, but you know what I mean. Oh, I don't like that. That's too on top of that one. I know, I'm really picky when it comes to stuff like that. Now let's see if I can actually take this off. Okay, don't rip, don't rip. You're my only purple one. Okay, we got this, we got this. Oh. Get a little nervous, aha, got it. Okay, so because I've got there, I just don't want it directly across, so I'm gonna try to maybe put this one here, I don't know. I don't know, hold on, Let me, maybe I should place this one first. This is so crooked, but whatever, whatever. Because if that one's down, Maybe I'll put this one right in the middle of it because I don't know how to. Let's look, let's look. Okay. I mean, I could put this this way. Here, I'm barely tapping it down. I'm just trying to get a visual of what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure about that. I feel like if that one just came down, then I could put this one where I want it. But then I'm moving everything around. Who knew this would be so difficult today for me? Just kidding. I'm trying to tap it onto the tape because it'll easily move. You know, I'm going to do that. This is this is the way I'm going to do it. Oh, okay. Just going to kind of put this one here. There we go. That way it's just not directly across. I'm okay with that. And this last one, I could put it here, but I don't like it lining up. So I'm gonna just kind of have it where I kind of put it before and it's just gonna overlap right here. There we go. All right, we have a lot of little tombstone situations going on, but that added a bunch of patterns. So I, I'm, I'm happy with this so far. Okay. Um, 
Now, let's see about adding some of these stickers. I figured this would be a pretty quick spread because, I mean, I already added a bunch of pattern. I probably don't even need to add any washi because <laughs> I've got all this pattern going on. Um, so it should be pretty, like a pretty easy, quick spread. All right, let me think. This little purple, I feel like I want another ghosty on, oh, the pumpkin on the skateboard guy. There's so many options. Okay, I'm gonna put this cute little guy right here. I'll just kind of, you know what? Maybe each box gets a ghosty. Each box is gonna get one. And then, maybe I should put, no, put him down. And then I'm gonna put maybe a pumpkins. I can I just wanna cover that. I don't know, it just doesn't seem to go for me. So I'm like, I don't want that there. All right, and I'm gonna put this flower here, and I'm not oh I'm not really putting them in the center. I'm kind of putting it, that one looks like it, but kind of off-centered a little bit. And then what's gonna go on this guy? Maybe, hmm. The called, oh, the candy corn, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they're separate, so I can just kinda put one here, and then the second one can go maybe over here. And now I'm just gonna kinda go through and add different things in different spots, but I wanna put this little bus. Do I wanna use this purple guy over here? I could cut off and it'll mimic this if I just kinda of cut just straight across the bottom. Okay, straight was the optimal word. Hey, that's not too bad, not too shabby. Okay. Hold on, I'm going to do a quick little kind of cluster of some different boxes. Let me see what else we have going on. Um, I know Tuesday we have an appointment, so I'm gonna put, okay, hold on. I'm grabbing, grabbing boxes, okay. Maybe even another, well, no, though, not orange there. All right, I'm gonna put this one here. And this here, here we go. And then I'm gonna grab orange box somewhere in here. I know there's more, come on. Oh, I don't want one that says remember. Aha, plain orange, here we go. I'm gonna grab an orange and probably black. I feel like orange and black will be good. Let me look, what do I have on this side? Hmm. I think I'm gonna do this. Here, here we go. Okay, perfect. Now I can get back to some of these and I'm gonna add this little cauldron with its puff of smoke. That's kind of fun. Right here in this bus. I feel like, I don't know why putting this in the air bothers me. I feel like it needs to be grounded. So it's going to live right here in this corner. I know. It's just how my brain works. It, I feel like it cannot be in the sky. And this little guy too, he needs to be on something. So I might put him, oh, there's a pumpkin right there. Where can he live? He can't be on the edge, eh, on a curve. I do like him here. Or there. 
I don't like this being opposite. See, I'm ridiculously picky. This is silly. Okay. Oh, maybe you could be here. Mm, yeah. Because I feel like here, I really like him here, but I don't like that pumpkin there. I could move the pumpkin. That'd probably be the fastest. Let's do it. Let's do it. So much for me being fast. I say that every time, like, oh, this is going to be so fast and easy. And then, you know, 30 minutes later. Okay. I just think he's cute on this. Like he's uh, skating. Okay. And then I can put this guy here. And we have a bunch of purple pumpkins. Ooh, these bats would be kind of fun on this. There we go. That's cute. There, I'm liking that. And then I've got a flower here. Oh, I'm going to put this spider web kind of in the corner up here just for fun. Like he's attached. Right? Oh, the perfect. It's like he's attached on those edges. And then this little spider. I don't know if I want him on it. Oh, I know. I'm going to do this. I'm going to put him here and then I'll draw like a line like he's dropping down. I don't know. We'll see. I think it'd be cute though. All right. And then the hat. I'm now I'm just going in and adding decor. And there's plenty of room for me later to add you know, extra boxes and other things and I've got a bunch of colors that would work, so I think that'll be good. All right. And we've got this little purple pumpkin. I'm going to add him up here to this little trio. All right. What else can I add? I'm going to add a flower. I just love these. They're so fun. All this like, you know, 60s vibe. It's just like cutesy and spooky together. And I love it. It's such a fun mix. All right. And then I'm going to put this guy here. Adding my things in threes. You know what I always do. All right. And then I'm going to put maybe a flower here. And I'm trying to think. I don't know if I want to use both bats together or I could put this little spooky hand. Let's see. I feel like it's because it's so many like dark things. I know. Maybe this little. What about this guy? Is he too big? No. We're just going to put him here. There. Now I've got a cluster there. Oh, that's kind of fun. It's just fun to just, these, you know, you can just kind of add anywhere in. So it's kind of pretty fun. Okay. So. I think I'm almost done with this one. I'm gonna put this little pumpkin right here. Do I want them together? Well, I'm gonna lift this and kind of put the little hat over it. Like it's layered. Alrighty. That's one thing about these vinyl stickers. Is they're so good for like repositioning things. Okay, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like that. And, okay, I've got one little bat. I have to use him. He's got to go on here somewhere. Because, look, I finished a whole sticker sheet. Okay. Um, Where is my little bat going? Mm -mm, maybe here. I'm like, he's flying around <laughs> trying to find a home. I'm going to put him right here. There we go. That's where he's living. All right. It's done. I think all I need to do is add a little, I mean, I could just use a pen 
or a click art marker and just maybe draw a line. Here, I'm gonna test it out. I'll test it out with pencil just to see if I like it first. And I'm gonna use, this is my straight edge, just for the heck of it. And I'm just gonna draw a line, whoa, from this to the spider web. Ooh, I might even just leave it in pencil. It's cute. All right, and I'm done. A super fast and easy spread. And I love that I used kind of something different and fun with my packing tape. So you guys have to tell me if you experiment with something different in your planner um, and use it as decoration. And I would love it if you'd hit that like, subscribe, and reminder bell so you can get notifications when I post new videos. And you can also follow me over on Instagram at mom and a girl with plants. And I hope you guys have an amazing week ahead.